my name is Emily and I help busy women who have a general idea of what they should be doing when it comes to working out and eating clean. Just doing it and doing it consistently is something they struggle with. So I'm actually in Walt Disney World. We brought our little guy here. We're doing a trip with my sister before she heads off to college and she's actually in the background while I'm filming this for you. Um, but one thing that I was thinking about as we've been here is how in the past, when I would go on trips or travel, I would say, you know what, I'm going to just eat whatever, I'm going to enjoy being on vacation. And I threw everything out of the window as far as having a clean eating plan. And the reason behind that was years ago, I didn't have a clean eating plan that was something I could consistently stick with and that was easy to follow. Instead, I was following a really strict diet. I hate diets now, and that's because I believe diets stand for ditch it every time. What I believe instead is that you have to have a clean eating plan in place that's flexible so that when you're in a place like Disney, you can still enjoy a Mickey Mouse ice cream if that's something that you like, but that you also aren't paralyzed when you're going out to eat thinking that you have to just eat. It's starting to rain a little bit, that you just have to eat salads if you want to stay on track because that's not the case. There are lots of delicious options out there, especially in a lot of amusement parks now. They're even in Disney, they have different paleo options that they're marking directly on their menus for you, which is pretty cool. Now, what my tips are for when you're traveling, what I typically do is when I order, instead of just looking at a menu, if I don't see something that's maybe marked as like a lighter menu or here they have the paleo menu, so that made things easy, is I'll ask a waiter and say, what different protein sources do you have? and then I'll ask if they can grill it and then I'll ask what veggies they have. So I'll in a way create my own plate. Now if you're following, maybe you're counting macros or maybe you're just looking at your palm trying to gauge your protein source there or if you are on a plan. So maybe you're one of our fit chicks right now and you're watching this video and you're monitoring how many ounces you get because that's what we do. We don't count calories. We don't count macros. We just focus on ounces once we've cooked our meals. You can ask a waiter and I promise you they're going to know exactly how many ounces that protein is and they'll be able to help you come up with a really healthy and delicious option. Now, if you're not one of our fit chicks right now and you're struggling when it comes to eating clean and staying on track when you're traveling or just maybe when life throws some crazy curveballs your way, I want you to head over to fittoneproject.com right now. When you get there, you'll be able to set up a strategy session with one of our coaches. When you come in, we'll deep dive into different diets you've tried, things that you're struggling with right now, and help you create a game plan based around your lifestyle to help you hit your goals in the fastest time possible. Head over to fittoneproject.com right now and I can't wait to meet you.